Hi Aries, welcome to my Prime Moon Child. My name is Kaylee. This is your general weekly tarot reading. Sorry it's a day late. Uh, last week went crazy hectic. However, I am doing these. I'm determined to do these today. Um, so let's see what we have for you this week. As always, the housekeeping is all down below with decks and how to put personal readings along with the subscription button if you um, so decide to subscribe. Um, the card that's first come out for you today is the Ten of Swords. This is the energy of kind of being so done. I am so done, so done. I am so ready for a new start. Um, the good news about the Ten of Swords is that it's rock bottom. It can't get any worse than it is right now. Uh, this is some form of betrayal possibly. Um, someone's been sabotaging you, Aries. Someone has been sabotaging you and um, you are so done i mean i don't know if they they are sabotaging you or they have sabotaged you this is this is some ultimate betrayal that um has come to the surface whether it is recent right now or whether it's past stuff but something that you thought could be incredible isn't you think that's hence the betrayal but um there is wisdom to be gained from this experience there is growth to be had from this experience if you look there is a snake emerging from that egg that has been destroyed but it has survived despite that um and the snake energy is all about wisdom the good news is that you do you are now aware of it things can't get any better can't get any better they can't get any worse they can get a lot better hell of a lot better that's why i had the word better in my head um they can't get any worse than they are right now this is rock bottom it's not going to be as painful as it is right now from here on up it is healing um you also have the sun the 10 is also the end of that cycle of that phase of mental anxiety um you have the sun which is unencumbered joy it's freedom it's liberation it's light it's things becoming apparent, things becoming clear, your pathway will no longer be locked, uh, locked, blocked, locked or blocked. And the only way from here is up. I love that song, The Only Way Is Up. It always reminds me of that card. Um, you also have The Fall, and The Fall is all about taking a leap into the next new phase. So a new start for you is very much on the horizon. If it's not here right now, then it is within the next 30 days. That If you're not in this energy of sun and enjoyment, and light and it is a shiny bright new phase for you it is full of joy and happiness um fun as we go in towards summer um things very much opening up for you um and very much a new beginning i think spring was quite hard for you i think spring is the new trigger has been the trigger for this new phase this new beginning coming in um the fall is knowing that you can take the leap knowing that you are willing to put in the hard work and the effort um, and the drive and the passion in order to make this this calling that you know you're supposed to do this new start that you're supposed to be doing knowing um, even though others tell you it's probably a silly idea you know it is a good idea and you know what to do in order to make it successful um, you have the sun so it should be make hay while the sunshine is really coming through and it's very much this kind of energy of, I know it will be okay. I know that the universe has me. I know that um, everything will be okay, that it will work out for me because I am willing to have the grit and determination. I am willing to put in the effort. I am willing to invest emotionally in it. Um, and if you look, all four elements are in each corner. You have the, the wands, the swords, the pentacles and the cups. The masculine and the feminine combined. Um, it's about taking that leap that leap into the unknown and as terrifying as it is it's necessary your intuition is telling you that it's necessary that you do this now that you take this leap that you you you've weighed up the risk and you know that you can make it work out um, and because you're putting that much effort and determination and commitment into it the universe matches your energetic resonance um, and drops opportunities into you as and when you need them because you are full of gratitude you are full of positivity you are full of um light and hope um you also have the six of wands as a final card and the six of wands is uh, recognition and success for hard endeavors and work and passion projects that you are bringing 
to into being so the fact that you have the sun with the fall and the fall card as long as you're putting the effort in and you are paying your dues and making sure that you are doing what is necessary as and when it is required to maintain and ensure that you um get a healthy yield or payback from all the work that you're doing um you will be successful publicly recognized as well on this um project or whatever it is that you are trying to bring into being Aries um I hope that has been of some use to you hopefully I will see you again next week if you want to be notified of next week's reads by all means subscribe down below and do the little um dingling alarm bell and um I'll let you know when the next weekly reads are up thank you so much for watching I will see you again soon bye for now